This is a very simple vegan snack that is easy to make and does not require a lot of steps or anything too extra. So I'm going to break these crackers up. By the way, the brand of crackers these are W-A-S-A, Wasa. And in particular, this is the sourdough variety. Because of all the varieties of the Wasa crackers I've looked at or that I have access to at uh, Kroger's in this case, I find that the sourdough version is the best one, in my opinion, in terms of uh, good ingredients. Going to add some apple cider vinegar. Now, this whole process that I'm doing, you can also do in a sealable um, a sealable bag, right? A sealable plastic bag. And I that's what I usually do. I usually don't do the bowl. But using a bowl in this case makes things more clear. And so I'm putting a little bit of apple cider vinegar here. That's the main ingredient, actually. Because the objective is to moisten and add moisture to the crackers. I'm going to add a little bit of Himalayan pink salt. And that's going to add just a little bit of taste to it. And then you could add olive oil. And usually when I put this in a sealable plastic bag, which I usually do, I add a little bit of olive oil. Except I'm not going to do that this time, right? Even if I were to use the sealable plastic bag, I might add just a little dusting of cocoa powder, dark chocolate cocoa powder, right? And that's going to add just a little bit of flavor to it as well. But the main thing that I want to do here is I want to add some almond nut butter, right? And this one is the one ingredient variety, just one ingredient, roasted almonds. And so this is the version that I like the most. I've tried uh, three different versions of this one from this brand, and this is my favorite one. And so there I am. I'm going to douse this with some almond nut butter and that's going to really amp things up a bit. So, so far, we got four or five ingredients. We got the crackers themselves, apple cider vinegar, Himalayan pink salt, and almond nut butter, right? And a little bit of cocoa powder, right? And then you can take, you can take this in a, in a number of directions from here. You can add some pistachios. You can do whatever, right? And I like to stir this. Now, this is why I like to use the sealable plastic bag because I can just shake these ingredients up and it's going to distribute. It would distribute the ingredients a lot more, right? Let's taste this. Yeah, that's absolutely wonderful. And so this, this is one of my favorite snacks. I do variations on this. This is the variation that puts an emphasis on the almond nut butter, right? And so I absolutely love this one. And I also love the version where it's just Himalayan pink salt and olive oil, right? And usually I'll let it sit for a while before consuming it because I want the crackers to get soggy, get uh, borderline soggy. And that helps with digesting it and consuming it and having it processed through your system.